What's up, guys? How you guys doing? <laughs> I literally just came out of the shower, so that's why I look like a fucked up bird at the moment. Oh man, I was about to like not make this video, but I already filmed this event, so might as well put it to use so I don't, you know, waste footage. So me and the girlfriend, we went to a um, art walk with some friends and other good shit. Now where I live, we have like a lot of like downtown areas, you know, uh, Santa Ana, Orange, Long Beach area. Some other areas that are a bit of a drive and usually every month they always have like an art walk, right? It's like usually one day out of the month, depending either like the beginning or end of the month, they always have an art walk, you know? Basically a lot of like studios, they open up their artwork or a lot of pop-up booths. They basically uh, set up their merch, you know, art related stuff and then they just, you know, sell the stuff, right? It's cool. It's fun. But the thing is that like, you know, we've gone to these so often like after a while they're very similar so it's almost like <laughs> there's nothing new in the sense of me like filming this shit and like uh just talking about it but uh this event was different in the sense that like one of my friends actually she um had a booth set up right and we went to go and you know you know support her visit her and all the good stuff and yeah it's like uh i guess like the first time doing that doing a booth or an art event uh in orange right where this thing was at now i'm all into the art scene i love art you know i like museums i like doing all that cool shit right but i didn't see too much art as i thought it would be right if anything like uh this was up in orange uh it's a famous downtown orange area in orange county but uh you know, for the most part like even a lot of stores closed early it was like yeah it was like from one to five so like, it wasn't that big of a deal usually the one that we go to is the one in santa Ana. that one's like more fun actually they have like music outside they have more art districts actually uh art studios in one location where you can check out some new artwork you know uh there's more vendors there there's more music more food and some and all that so out of all the art uh related stuff that we checked out that happens mostly around me uh santa Ana is the best one in my opinion yeah this one was cool but it was pretty short so mainly what we did was like we ended up like uh checking out a lot of antique stores because that's mainly what this area has a lot of downtown areas usually have a lot of antique shops you know historic stuff so we just mainly visited and walked around and checked out a lot of that shit one in particular, it has a lot of cool retro stuff that, you know, we, we like to check out. But, I mean, besides that, there's really nothing <laughs> else to really talk about. Part of the reason me and Sarah started to, like, uh, record ourselves with a mic, it's more fun and engaging and easier for me to edit when, like, uh, I go to these types of events, right? As we're walking around, I could just film something and we can talk it to the camera and there you go, right? But um, I didn't do that this um, this time in because we're walking around with a lot of friends, right? So, yeah, for the most part, like... Uh, this event was more of like hanging out with friends and like, you know, supporting a friend as an artist, right? So that was the main goal and that's what we did. So, you know, besides that, everything else was great, you know, I had a good time. But unfortunately, a lot of downtown areas where I'm at, like um, the charm of it, of maintaining that like uh, downtown feel, somewhat of a historic community, it's, uh, it's definitely slowly dying. Just about every downtown area around me. Uh, has become almost like a hangout spot you know all the restaurants they turn into nightclubs and stuff like that or restaurants they you know they say they're restaurants but in reality they're just bars to hang out with and you know to have live music or djs or shit like that so i was like yeah i don't know the thing that's happening with this area it has that historic vibe to an extent but at the same time it's like slowly morphing into like a almost like a hangout night spot really you know for kids especially when there's like a a, a school nearby it tends to be like the major fucking focus. It's like, if there's a school nearby, then yeah, it totally becomes like a total party environment. Good times. I was there to hang out with my friends mainly. That was uh, the main goal, and we did that. Everything else was bonus. <laughs> Alright guys, got nothing else to say. Thanks for, thank you for hanging out with me for a bit. I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.